In this video, we will begin solving word problems by translating information in the problem into a mathematical equation. Some key phrases we may need to translate along the way include the following. First is the word is, or were, was, or will be. All will generally translate to an equal sign. One-half is the same as three-sixth. One-half equals three-sixth. Another key phrase to notice is more than means we add. It's important to note that addition is built backwards. Five more than eight means we add five to the eight, eight plus five. Similarly, subtracted from or less than means we subtract, which is also built backwards. Five less than seven is seven minus five. Let's take a look at some problems where we have to solve using this translating method. In this problem, we see several key phrases. We see five less than three times a number. Five less than means we subtract five because it is built backwards. We subtract five from three times a number. We don't know what that number is, so we simply will make that number x. Next, we see this is 19. Is, we know, translates to an equal sign, equals 19. We now have the equation 3x minus 5 equals 19. We can quickly solve this equation by balancing through the equal sign and adding 5 to both sides. 3x equals 24. Next, we divide both sides by 3 to find x equals 8. This means our number is 8. 5 less than 3 times 8 is 19. Let's try another example where we have to translate several key phrases in the problem. Here, we see 7 more than. More than means we add, but it's built backwards, so we add the 7. To find out what we're adding 7 to, we continue reading. Twice a number. Twice means we multiply by 2. We don't know what the number is, so we will use our variable x. Next is the word is. We know is translates to an equal sign. 6 less than implies a subtraction problem, also built backwards, so we subtract the 6. To find out what we subtract from, we keep reading. 3 times the same number, 3 times that same number that we don't know, x. After translating the pieces, we now have an equation we can solve. Balancing through the equal sign, we start by moving the variables to the same side. Subtracting 2x from both sides will give us 7 equals 1x, or just x, minus 6. Finally, to get the x alone, we can add 6 to both sides. We find 13 equals x. Our number is 13. 7 more than twice 13 is 6 less than 3 times the same 13. By translating key phrases in a word problem, we can quickly make an equation that we can easily solve. As we do, it is important to remember that quite often addition and subtraction are built in the opposite order they are described in the problem.